everybody and welcome back to Leon Talks Film. So today I have another movie review for you and that is of the 2021 film Shiver Baby directed by Emma Seligman. I hope that's how you pronounce your name. If I got that wrong, I'm so sorry. It seems to be a trend. I'm really bad at pronunciations, but yeah, Shiver Baby 2021 film. It is probably one of my most rewatched films from the past few years. I mean, this only came out last year and I've seen it four times now, I think four or five times. It is fantastic. This is a film that I'm kind of obsessed with. It is a comedy, drama, horror film, I guess. It's like an anxiety attack on film is horror to you. Um, take Uncut Gems, make it a bit more Jewish, and make it about a bisexual girl, and you've got Shiver Baby. Um, yeah, this is an absolutely fantastic film. Our lead actress here, played by Rachel Sonnot, I hope that's how you pronounce her name, is absolutely fantastic. It's such an absolutely hilarious film, and it's basically about this girl here, Danny, and essentially, uh, she's kind of like a cool girl of sorts. She goes on like dating apps and has like sugar daddy of sorts, and then she goes to a shiver, which is kind of like the after party to a funeral, I guess, and bumps into her sugar daddy there. <laughs> I'm not going to say anything else because I'd love you to kind of just experience the film yourself and just see the twists and turns that the film kind of has in store. It is a film where it's literally changing up what's happening and making things even more intense by the minute, and I love it. It is like an escalation of events. It like starts off small scale, but by the end of it, you're like, oh my god, that didn't happen happen and then it happens and then something else happens and then something else happens and the film is shot like a horror film it has it has a very kind of like I don't know stringy score I I guess like I can't really explain it too much but you know like the type of horror like like scores like that that was probably a really bad uh, like <laughs> rendition of something like that but like the score you'd expect from a horror film you get it here and it kind of adds to the intensity of the lead character it is really really amazing stuff it's also absolutely hilarious like it sounds anxiety inducing and it is it definitely definitely is but it's also just a really really fun time it's like uh, so many of the lines in here are absolutely hilarious and the situations and predicaments that uh, our characters get into are just, oh, they're hilarious. They're absolutely hilarious. I really, really cannot wait to see what Emma directs next because this is a great, great, like, kind of bite-sized film. It only runs at about 70 or so minutes as well, so it's not like it's taking too much of your time. It's so lean. It's so perfect. It's, like, short enough to the point where you can watch it again and again and again like I have and show it to new people, but at the same time, it's like it doesn't ever drag on or anything, you know? It never drags the pacing is perfect and it's absolutely hilarious. I love the camera angles when the camera's getting super close up like this and it really kind of adds to that layer of anxiety that it's trying to deliver on and I think it succeeds with flying, flying colors. It's a film that I just can't get enough of really. I really can't and I'm so glad that Mubi distributed it over here and gave it a Blu-ray release. Uh, in terms of the Blu-ray, it's a pretty bare bones Blu-ray for the most part. I mean, you get a Q&A with the writer director. That's about it. There's no other bonus features features to be seen, but you do get this lovely, lovely slip cover here. It's really, really nice. And then inside, again, you've got the case here, nice case. And then the disc is obviously thematically appropriate. I will not spoil as to why, but definitely, definitely appropriate once you've seen the film. And it does come with the subtitles and stuff that you'd expect, a few audio options. I will say though, the audio mix on this seemed a bit iffy. Like, I don't know if that's because it was filmed and like released during the pandemic, but some of the audio seemed a bit cheap necessarily. I do know it's a very, very low budget film, but I don't know if it was an issue with the audio mixes. I did try both. I think that there's both a DTS 5.1 and a 2.0, and some of the audio just seemed a bit tinny almost. Uh, I don't know if that was down to ADR or something, but yeah, the audio mix is not perfect, but the film looks great. Like the visuals are stunning, and the film itself is just absolutely fantastic. So yeah, Shiver Baby, 9 out of 10. Love it to bits. Cannot recommend it enough. Even if you don't feel the need to like fork out £15 on it, go sign up for Movie or something, you know? Get a subscription, get, get a trial or something and then you can just watch it on there and cancel yourself you know i'm not sponsored by them yet movie sponsor me please 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 <laughs>
<laughs> I'm kidding. Or am I? Mm. Anyway, yeah, Shiva Baby. Watch it, watch it, watch it. It is amazing. Absolutely fantastic. Love it to bits. Anyway, that will do it for today's video. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. Comment below and tell me, have you seen Shiva Baby? And if you have, what do you think about it? I'd love to know. Let me know in the comment section below. And let me know if you end up checking it out based on this review. How are you enjoying these reviews so far? If you're, if you're a subscriber of the channel and you've been watching my videos for a while, do you like the reviews? Would you like me to switch up the style a bit more? Let me know. Let me know. I'm always experimenting around with this stuff and I just want to know what works. And I'm really enjoying doing these reviews. You know, they're, they're short, they're sweet, they're to the punch, but I get enough time to kind of talk about the films because that's kind of what I want to do on the channel. You know, I want to talk about movies. It's Leon Talks Film. So yeah. Anyway, stay safe. Have a fantastic day and I'll speak to you all later. Bye.